Venus will transit into Aries on April 23, 2024, and during this time, it will form conjunctions with the Sun, Jupiter, and Mercury in the same sign. It's important to highlight that these interpretations are drawn from sidereal or Vedic astrology, which considers a roughly 24-degree variance from the tropical zodiac. Venus embodies beauty, desire, love, and financial liquidity. It's also associated with marriage and all relationships, as well as our deepest desires. Venus represents wealth, conveniences, vehicles, and luxuries. Its highest representation is service and devotion, which is why Venus is exalted in Pisces, the natural twelfth house, where Venus is most pious. Aries, the first sign of the zodiac, corresponds to the themes and energies associated with the first house of the horoscope, such as the self and personality. Aries symbolizes traits related to individuality, aggression, action, and competitive spirit. Aries is governed by Mars. As Venus ventures into the fiery sign of Aries, it adopts the impulsive demeanor characteristic of this bold and dynamic sign. Aries, with its ready, fire, aim approach to life, propels Venus into an area of swift action and spontaneity. In this fiery environment, Venus finds itself leaping forward into relationships, opportunities, and encounters with unprecedented vigor. However, this impulsive energy can prove disconcerting for Venus, whose inherent qualities are more aligned with the comfort and stability associated with its rulership of Taurus, or the measured equilibrium of Libra. Despite the discomfort that may arise from this energetic mismatch, Venus in Aries offers invaluable insights into the workings of our desires and motivations. This period prompts deep introspection, urging us to examine what truly attracts us and why. Venus in Aries signifies a departure from the ambivalent, empathic stance characteristic of its preceding placement in Pisces, favoring a more direct and unfiltered approach in matters of the heart. The elemental alignment of Venus in Aries adds further nuance to its expression. As a fire sign, Aries imbues Venusian interactions with inspiration, vitality, and a sense of urgency. While this fiery energy may resonate harmoniously with Venus's Libra side, it can clash with the earthy sensibilities of Taurus, potentially dampening the flames of enthusiasm. Even though Aries opposes the qualities of Libra, it's still beneficial because it's a cardinal sign and shares the same axis with Libra as the the lover archetype. Venus's placement in Aries holds additional significance as it occupies its own 7th and 12th signs, governed by Libra and Taurus, respectively. In the seventh sign, Venus delves into the intricacies of balanced, equitable relationships, while in the twelfth, it seeks to express notions of fairness, justice, and equilibrium in a forthright manner. This unique positioning serves to deepen the exploration of Venusian themes within the context of partnerships and personal values, offering a multifaceted lens through which to understand the complexities of human connection. The entry of Venus into Aries signals a forward thrust towards new initiatives, values, and perspectives, particularly for those influenced by the energies of Taurus and Libra. It invites us to embrace and celebrate our ability to act on our terms, transcending indecision and embracing autonomy. However, amidst this newfound fervor, it is essential to remain vigilant against impulsiveness and the allure of fleeting desires. Enjoy this time because Aries brings enthusiasm, positivity, and a feeling of independence to our relationships and endeavors. It's a good time to speak up for what you desire because you might just get it. Jupiter departs from Aries on May 1st, and Mercury enters Aries on May 10th. Therefore, Venus will maintain a significant degree of separation from these planets. However, when Venus transits Aries and draws closer to a conjunction with the Sun, it carries profound implications, particularly concerning ego and relationships. The Sun signifies the ego, while Venus symbolizes relationships, and the interplay between these two can deeply affect individuals' lives. When they are further apart in degrees, it suggests that Venus's attributes of creativity and beauty are amplified by the sun's illuminating influence. This alignment often indicates prosperity and abundance for the individual. However, as Venus approaches closer to the sun, the phenomenon of combustion occurs. Despite the slight distance between them, there is still a fusion of their energies, which can bring about both challenges and opportunities. The conjunction of the sun and Venus highlights a potential clash between ego and relationships. The Sun, as the significator of ego, and Venus, as the significator of relationships, create a scenario where individuals may encounter conflicts and power struggles within their partnerships. Especially if Aries falls into relationship-oriented houses in their birth chart. As the conjunction tightens in degree proximity, these conflicts may intensify, potentially leading to significant challenges in the relationship. In some cases, the Sun-Venus conjunction can even contribute to divorce or breakup. 
Despite the potential challenges, there are also positive aspects to this conjunction, particularly concerning material aspects of life. Individuals with this alignment may possess extraordinary beauty, charm, and attractiveness, as Venus's natural allure is further magnified by the sun's radiant energy. Moreover, they may excel in creative endeavors such as arts, media, and movies, benefiting from the synergistic boost of Venus's creativity and the sun's vitality. Financial success and wealth accumulation may also be indicated by this configuration. Venus represents love and activities that bring joy. As Venus transits through different houses for approximately 25 days, it signifies an increased inclination towards activities associated with that specific house. The final outcomes may vary based on the dignity of Venus in the birth chart, but the common thread is an affinity towards engagements related to the house Venus is currently transiting. Venus primarily influences the Moon and Mercury and is relatively susceptible to the influence of malefic planets such as the Sun, Mars, Saturn, Rahu, and Ketu. To accurately assess the impact of these transits, it is crucial to consider your Ascendant and Moon signs. The Ascendant sign offers insights into the timing of life events, while the Moon sign reveals how you will emotionally respond to these changes. Take into account the position of your current Mahadasha Lord in your birth chart, as it can shed light on how these transits will influence the recurring themes of your current Dasha period. This transit may manifest differently for each individual, and how they navigate this transit will depend on their personal charts. A more precise understanding of the impact of this transit can be gained by examining Venus's Ashtakavarga score in Aries. Keep in mind that the effects of this transit are contingent on Venus's interaction with the planets in individual birth charts. It's also worth noting that individuals currently experiencing the influence of Venus Dasha may feel the effects of this transit more intensely. To understand how this transit may affect you based on your zodiac sign and the houses it transits, let's delve into those specifics. When Venus enters Aries, it indicates a period of significant influence on the lives of Aries individuals. With Venus gracing the first house, individuals will find themselves more focused on self-expression and physical appearance. This heightened sense of attractiveness may lead to increased attention to personal grooming and style updates. A pleasant and amiable disposition will make socializing and initiating new relationships particularly favorable during this transit. Self-love and care will take precedence, leading to a period of personal growth and positive changes. Venus's transit through Aries, affecting the first house, also extends its influence to the individual's personality, self, and mental capacity across all life facets. Given that Mars, the dispositor of this transit, a natural benefic planet for Aries, this transit is regarded as favorable, promising positive changes and happiness. The focus of Venus's journey through Aries will primarily be on relationships, family dynamics, and wealth. In terms of relationships, both new connections and existing ones will benefit from harmonious interactions and mutual understanding. Married individuals can expect a deepening emotional bond and intense physical intimacy. Family relationships will undergo progressive changes, fostering a sense of security and fulfillment. Financially, while stability is indicated, it's advised to save for emergencies and exercise caution with unnecessary expenditures. Communication takes focus during this transit with individuals enjoying flirtatious banter and intimate conversations. Investing in expensive communication devices, taking numerous pictures, and engaging in social media will be common activities. However, there's a caution against being perceived as characterless due to excessive indulgence. Instead, focus on self-care routines and the pursuit of luxury and comfort. The transit of Venus in Aries also prompts a strong inclination towards financial abundance and luxury. Investments made during this period are likely to yield profitable returns in the future. Luxurious items, jewelry, and cosmetics will hold particular allure. Gourmet meals and indulgent experiences will be enjoyed, further enhancing the sense of luxury and comfort. An increase in daily income is forecasted, along with gains in name, fame, and prosperity. Support from elders and familial blessings will contribute to overall well-being. Investments in precious metals like gold are favored, contributing to financial security and happiness. Venus as the second house lord transiting twelfth away in the first house suggests a period of reflection and may indicate a time where Aries individuals are prompted to reevaluate their financial strategies, reassess their values, and let go of some material attachments that no longer serve their growth. This could involve releasing old spending habits, clearing debts, 
or even experiencing temporary financial expenses. However, this process of release ultimately leads to a deeper understanding of their true values and self-worth. Venus as the seventh house lord transiting seventh away in the first house influences relationships, partnerships, and one-on-one -on -one connections. Aries individuals may find themselves more inclined to initiate and pursue equal, balanced relationships during this time. They may feel a stronger urge to express their desires and expectations clearly and directly in their partnerships. This transit encourages Aries individuals to bring harmony and fairness into their relationships by asserting their needs and boundaries without compromising their independence. Unmarried individuals may find opportunities for marriage, while those already married can expect stability and fulfillment. Business partnerships will thrive, and health will see a positive upturn. Foreign travel or encounters with foreign guests are indicated, adding excitement to the period. Maintaining respect and nurturing relationships, particularly with spouses and business partners, will ensure a harmonious and fulfilling transit. However, despite the positive outlook, minor health concerns such as skin rashes or dehydration may arise. It's essential to prioritize self-care and hydration during this period. Overall, the transit of Venus in Aries offers a transformative period characterized by enhanced self-expression, harmonious relationships, and financial prosperity. By embracing self-love, indulging in luxury, and nurturing meaningful connections, individuals can make the most of this favorable transit of Venus. Taurus individuals will find themselves navigating a period of introspection and spiritual reflection as Venus moves through their 12th house in Aries. This transit encourages a deeper connection with the divine and fosters empathy and compassion towards others. Taurus individuals may feel drawn to solitude, contemplative practices, or acts of service behind the scenes. Romantic encounters during this time may possess a dreamy, otherworldly quality, possibly involving connections with individuals from foreign cultures. With Venus, the planet of beauty and harmony, traversing Aries, the twelfth house from Taurus, there's a theme of introspection, closure, and possibly even losses regarding matters related to the self, identity, and overall well-being. Taurus individuals may find themselves drawn towards reflecting on their inner desires, dreams, and spiritual growth during this time. There might be a sense of letting go of old self-concepts, patterns of behavior, or even relationships that no longer serve their higher purpose. While this process may initially feel challenging, it ultimately paves the way for a more authentic and liberated sense of self. However, despite the spiritual potential of this transit, Venus's journey through the 12th house may pose challenges for Taurus individuals. While Venus governs the Taurus ascendant and 6th house, this position in Aries may not be entirely beneficial due to its placement in the 12th house. Despite potential professional opportunities such as travel abroad, Taurus individuals are cautioned to approach their tasks with commitment, dedication, and hard work to ensure seamless progress. Personal relationships will require attention during this transit, with Taurus individuals urged to spend quality time with family, spouses, or partners. However, excessive spending on luxuries for loved ones may need to be balanced with financial responsibility. It's crucial to maintain honesty and decorum in interactions to avoid household strife or legal complications. Health concerns may arise due to stress during this transit, prompting Taurus individuals to prioritize self-care. Adhering to a balanced diet, exercise regimen, and incorporating practices like yoga and meditation can support physical fitness and mental well-being. Despite the allure of luxury and cosmetic products, moderation is advised to prevent excessive spending. Taurus individuals may experience a dip in confidence during this transit, with a heightened sex drive potentially leading to challenges in romantic relationships. Students may encounter opportunities for studying abroad but could struggle with maintaining concentration. Caution is advised for those trying to conceive or who are already pregnant, as complications may arise. The transit of Venus in Aries opens doors to foreign-related activities, including visa approvals and opportunities for travel. However, Taurus individuals must exercise caution against indulging in materialistic pleasures excessively, as it may lead to moral dilemmas or extramarital affairs. Financially, there may be opportunities for promotions or increments, but involvement in legal matters should be avoided. Despite the challenges, Venus's aspect on the sixth house in Libra signifies liberation from disease, debt, and enemies. Unemployed individuals may find job opportunities, and pending financial matters may see resolution. The transit of Venus in the twelfth house brings positivity and enjoyment, particularly carnal pleasures with a partner. However, Taurus individuals are advised to be mindful of their emotional responses and to maintain control over their behavior to navigate this transit successfully. 
new contracts, deals, and business partnerships may emerge, promising growth and prosperity for Taurus individuals during this period. Overall, while the transit of Venus through the 12th house in Aries brings opportunities for spiritual growth and foreign-related activities, Taurus individuals must navigate challenges with caution. By prioritizing self-care, maintaining balance in relationships and finances, and exercising restraint in indulgences, Taurus individuals can make the most of this transit. With diligence and mindfulness, this period holds the potential for personal and professional growth, paving the way for a brighter future ahead. Gemini individuals will find their focus shifting towards friendships, social networks, and long-term goals as Venus graces their 11th house in Aries. This transit brings with it a plethora of opportunities for expanding social circles, forming new friendships, and strengthening existing ones. Collaboration, group activities, and involvement in social causes are highlighted during this time, potentially leading to financial gains, rewards, or recognition through networking efforts. Venus's rulership over the 5th and 12th houses of Gemini underscores the importance of love, children, spending, and loss during this transit. While Venus transits through the 11th house, which is responsible for income, gains, wish fulfillment, and social interactions, a generally positive outlook is indicated, especially for those who are cautious with their finances. As the 12th Lord transiting 12th away in the 11th house, this period suggests a period of introspection and perhaps letting go for Gemini individuals in matters related to the 12th house, which encompasses spirituality, subconscious patterns, isolation, and hidden enemies. There may be a sense of closure or completion regarding spiritual practices. It's a time for releasing old emotional baggage and making peace with the past in order to move forward with clarity and renewal. Venus as the fifth house lord transiting seventh away in the eleventh house, this transit encourages collaboration and cooperation in creative endeavors, as well as opportunities for romantic encounters or deepening existing relationships. Gemini individuals may feel inspired to express themselves creatively and authentically in their interactions with their social circles and others, seeking harmony and balance in their personal and artistic pursuits. Financial security and the fulfillment of materialistic desires are forecasted during this period. Gemini individuals are likely to see gains and profits from their professions, with entrepreneurial ventures and international connections offering avenues for professional advancement. The strong bonds shared with spouses or partners promise a fulfilling romantic life, while those who are single may find themselves entering committed relationships. The emphasis on social life and networking suggests that Gemini individuals will enjoy strong bonds with friends and meaningful socializing experiences. Romantic connections with partners and academic success for children are highlighted during this transit. However, it's essential to avoid neglecting financial priorities, as doing so may disrupt leisure time with loved ones. Gemini individuals are urged to maintain balance in their pursuits, ensuring that both financial and personal aspects of life are tended to. Opportunities to earn from foreign sources, engage in remote work for foreign companies, and receive support from maternal figures are indicated during this transit. While business ties with foreigners may develop, caution is advised against potential financial expenses through friendships. Investments in real estate could prove lucrative, but cautious spending is crucial to avoid setbacks. Venus's aspect on the fifth house further enhances the potential for financial gains, particularly for those under the influence of Venus Mahadasha and Antarctica. Wealth accumulation, multiple income sources, and support from authority figures are highlighted, along with the possibility of love affairs blossoming into marriage. Gemini individuals involved in networking or group gatherings stand to gain significantly during this transit. Wishes may be fulfilled, and unexpected gains may materialize, especially for those with a creative streak or involvement in the entertainment industry. Support from friends and siblings adds to the overall productivity and success experience during this period. The aspect from the 11th house to the 5th house signifies substantial gains from abroad, confirmed invitations or relationships, and an overall sense of happiness and comfort. Gemini individuals are advised to focus on their work while nurturing positive relationships with children and fostering their interests. Overall, the transit of Venus in Aries presents Gemini individuals with a multitude of opportunities for personal and professional growth. By maintaining financial discipline, nurturing relationships, and embracing opportunities for growth, Gemini individuals can make the most of this auspicious transit and pave the way for a prosperous and fulfilling future. For Cancer individuals, Venus, the planet of love, beauty, and harmony, moves into the fiery sign of Aries, igniting the 10th house of career, reputation, and public image. 
This transit signals a pivotal period where professional aspirations take focus, offering opportunities for growth, recognition, and success. As Venus casts its gentle influence over this domain, cancer individuals can expect to experience a wave of popularity, enhance relationships with authority figures and colleagues, and a favorable trajectory in their professional endeavors. For cancer individuals, Venus's transit through the 10th house holds particular significance, as it governs their career, status, and financial security. With Venus also ruling over the 4th and 11th houses, which pertain to comforts, stability, and gains, this transit brings a fusion of energies that intertwine personal fulfillment with professional pursuits. However, despite the promise of professional advancement, some challenges may arise in personal relationships. Nonetheless, adept social skills and effective communication can help navigate these challenges, especially for female professionals striving to balance career demands with familial responsibilities. Venus as the 11th house lord transiting 12th away in the 10th house, cancer individuals may find themselves reassessing their social circles and long-term objectives during this time. There could be a sense of closure regarding certain friendships or goals that no longer align with their growth or values. As Venus is traditionally associated with love, this transit may see cancer individuals focusing more on their professional aspirations and public image rather than social connections. Venus as the fourth house lord transiting seventh away in the tenth house, cancer individuals may find themselves focusing on creating harmony and balance in their domestic environment and family relationships. There could be opportunities for deeper emotional connections with loved ones, as well as potential for new partnerships or collaborations that involve home-related matters. Partnerships play a crucial role during this transit, with Venus's influence indicating potential expansion or new ventures, particularly in sectors related to luxury goods or cosmetics. While personal relationships may face strains, Venus's aspect offers avenues for domestic harmony if efforts are made to nurture and strengthen bonds. Cancer individuals are encouraged to explore innovative solutions to bolster both personal relationships and financial stability during this period. Property matters come into focus under the influence of Venus, with the possibility of advantageous sales or transactions. However, disruptions in domestic bliss may occur alongside relationship challenges and potential expenses related to home matters. Cancer individuals may find themselves providing support to paternal figures in need, reflecting the nurturing nature of their sign. Despite the potential for professional success, cancer individuals may experience a temporary disconnect from their spiritual side, and travel plans may encounter obstacles during this transit. Students, particularly those in creative fields, may find it challenging to concentrate on their studies, potentially impacting pursuits of higher education. The transit of Venus, as the lord of the fourth and eleventh houses, through the tenth house signifies heightened activity and socializing in the workplace for cancer individuals. Promotions, financial gains, and fruitful partnerships are indicated, promising a period of growth and prosperity. Relationships with fathers are highlighted positively, suggesting good health and harmonious connections. Business ventures receive a significant boost during this transit, with favorable outcomes for investments and property dealings. Real estate professionals, builders, and property dealers stand to benefit from lucrative opportunities, including commissions and brokerage. Overall, Venus's transit through the 10th house presents a transformative period for cancer individuals, marked by professional growth, financial prosperity, and personal development. While challenges may arise in personal relationships and domestic matters, Proactive efforts to nurture connections and explore innovative solutions will pave the way for success. By embracing the opportunities presented during this transit, cancer individuals can navigate this period with grace and emerge stronger and more fulfilled in both their professional and personal lives. For Leo individuals, the entrance of Venus into Aries brings a wave of transformative energy, particularly as it transits their ninth house. This transit inspires a profound sense of adventure, expansion, and philosophical inquiry. Leo individuals may feel compelled to embark on journeys of exploration, both physical and intellectual, as they seek to broaden their horizons and deepen their understanding of the world. This transit encourages pursuits such as travel, higher education, and spiritual growth, offering opportunities for personal and professional development. With Venus governing Leo's houses of initiative, younger siblings, short professional travel, and status, its transit through the ninth house holds significant implications for various aspects of their lives. While professional activities are set to advance, personal relationships may require careful attention due to the inherent differences in temperament between Venus and the Sun. Leo individuals are advised to navigate these dynamics with awareness and sensitivity, 
ensuring that their personal connections remain harmonious amidst their professional pursuits. Venus as the 10th house lord transiting 12th away in the 9th house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the 10th house, which governs career, public image, and reputation. Leo individuals may find themselves reassessing their professional goals, ambitions, and public standing during this time. There could be a sense of closure regarding certain career paths or achievements that no longer resonate with their true aspirations or values. This transit encourages Leo individuals to let go of outdated career objectives and embrace new opportunities that align more closely with their authentic selves. The transit of Venus in Aries promises benefits for Leo individuals engaged in long professional trips, particularly those involving creative fields such as media and journalism. Leo's eloquence of speech may prove instrumental in generating rewards during this period, as they capitalize on opportunities to showcase their talents and expertise. Venus's alignment with Leo's third house of initiative and hobby suggests that pursuing one's interests as a career path can yield favorable outcomes during this transit. In personal relationships, Leo individuals are poised to find fulfillment through their own efforts to improve themselves and prioritize their partners and family members. Singles may feel inclined to commit to meaningful relationships, while those in partnerships can deepen their bonds through quality time and genuine gestures of affection. Financial planning and savings are also highlighted during this period, although Leo individuals are cautioned to remain mindful of their ego and its potential impact on their progress. Professionally, Leo individuals are in for a period of growth and success during Venus's transit through Aries. Job seekers may land their dream positions, while those already employed may experience increased energy and enthusiasm in pursuing their goals. Careers in creative fields such as fashion, media, journalism, and hospitality are particularly favored, with opportunities for recognition and acclaim. Leo writers may find themselves on the brink of achieving worldwide recognition, with their creative endeavors reaching new heights of success. This transit presents favorable conditions for travel, especially overseas ventures and endeavors related to publishing and communication. Leo individuals may find themselves publishing their work or securing lucrative opportunities abroad. Awards and accolades may come their way, bolstering their reputation and status in their respective fields. However, Leo individuals are advised to exercise caution when it comes to financial dealings involving female individuals. Lending money or engaging in financial transactions with them during this period may result in adverse consequences. Overall, Venus's transit through the ninth house of Leo indicates a period of expansion, growth, and opportunity. As they embark on journeys of exploration and self-discovery, Leo individuals stand to reap the rewards of their efforts, both personally and professionally. By navigating the complexities of relationships with awareness and sensitivity, while harnessing their creative talents and pursuing their passions, Leo individuals can make the most of this transformative transit and emerge stronger and more fulfilled than ever before. For Virgo individuals, Venus's transition into Aries marks a significant event as it begins its journey through their eighth house. This transit carries profound implications, delving into themes of intimacy, transformation, and shared resources. Virgo individuals are urged to embark on a journey of self-discovery and exploration, delving into the depths of their emotions and psyche. The Eighth House's influence prompts Virgo individuals to engage in research, introspection, and the pursuit of hidden truths, leading to a deeper understanding of themselves and the world around them. With Venus governing Virgo's second and ninth houses, which encompass speech, family, finance, luck, and spirituality, its transit through the eighth house signifies a period of mixed influences. While Venus finds itself in a friendly conjunction with Mercury in Virgo, it is also in Mars' sign, potentially tempering its effects on overall outcomes for Virgo individuals. Nonetheless, there are indications of potential rewards and growth in financial matters, with hard work and efforts likely to be commended and rewarded. Venus as the ninth house lord transiting twelfth away in the eighth house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the ninth house, which governs higher education, spirituality, beliefs, and long-distance travel. Virgo individuals may find themselves reassessing their beliefs, ideologies, and spiritual practices during this time. There could be a sense of closure regarding certain philosophical or educational pursuits that no longer resonate with their evolving worldview. This transit encourages Virgo individuals to let go of limiting beliefs and embrace new perspectives and experiences that expand their consciousness and understanding of the world. Venus as the second house lord transiting seventh away, Virgo individuals may find themselves focusing on creating harmonious connections and collaborations in matters related to finances, resources, and values. There could be opportunities for financial partnerships, joint ventures, 
or negotiations that lead to mutual benefits and shared prosperity. On a personal level, Virgo individuals may find themselves navigating challenges within family dynamics and encountering disagreements with their partners or spouses during this transit. However, amidst potential tensions, their bond with in-laws is expected to remain resilient. Despite any personal conflicts, Virgo individuals are encouraged to prioritize their own growth and development, ensuring that familial and relationship issues are addressed with care and sensitivity. Health and well-being assume paramount importance during this transit, with Virgo individuals advised to prioritize self-care practices such as maintaining balanced diets, engaging in regular exercise routines that incorporate yoga and meditation, and fostering habits that promote physical fitness and mental peace. Such measures are essential for nurturing a strong immune system and sustaining vitality amidst the challenges posed by this transit. However, Virgo individuals may encounter obstacles and setbacks in various aspects of life during this period. Attempts at flirtation or social interaction may feel awkward or ineffective, potentially leading to misunderstandings or even scandals if pursued recklessly. Financially, there may be a tendency to overspend, particularly on indulgent pleasures such as food, and investments are not recommended during this time and creative endeavors may feel stifled or stagnant. Plans for travel or higher education may encounter roadblocks and delays, with obstacles hindering progress in these areas. While foreign-related activities may see some success, Virgo individuals may find themselves grappling with significant struggle and difficulty. Those planning to travel abroad between April 25th and May 19th are advised to exercise caution and be prepared for potential challenges or setbacks. Overall, Venus's transit through the 8th house for Virgo individuals indicates a period of introspection, transformation, and potential challenges. While financial rewards and familial support may offer some solace, the overall tone of this transit underscores the importance of caution and diligent self-care. By navigating the complexities of relationships, managing financial matters prudently, and prioritizing health and well-being, Virgo individuals can navigate this period of transition with resilience and emerge stronger and more self-aware than before. Libra individuals find themselves enveloped in a transformative wave of energy as Venus gracefully transits into Aries, particularly as it transits their seventh house. This transit places a significant emphasis on relationships, partnerships, and one-on-one -on -one connections, igniting a spark of romantic fervor and interpersonal harmony. Libra individuals, ruled by Venus, the planet of love and beauty, are naturally inclined towards seeking harmony and balance in their relationships, and this transit amplifies these tendencies urging them towards deeper connections and meaningful partnerships. The seventh house is traditionally associated with marriage, partnerships, and alliances, making this transit a pivotal time for Libra individuals in matters of the heart. Whether in existing relationships or on the cusp of new romantic adventures, Libra individuals may experience a deepening of emotional bonds and a heightened sense of intimacy. There's a magnetic allure to Venus in Aries, inspiring Libra individuals to seek out companionship and forge connections that resonate on a soul level. The importance of harmony, compromise, and cooperation in relationships is magnified during this period, urging Libra individuals to navigate their interactions with grace and understanding. With Venus also governing Libra's first and eighth houses, which represent self, nature, personality, obstacles, and unexpected gains and losses, its transit through the seventh house holds profound implications for both personal and professional spheres. Despite being in Aries, Venus's influence over Libra ensures a blend of progress and transformations offering opportunities for growth and self-discovery amidst potential obstacles. Libra individuals may find themselves grappling with internal and external conflicts, but these challenges serve as catalysts for personal growth and transformation. With Venus as the 8th house lord transiting 12th away in the 7th house, there's a theme of closure and transformation in matters related to the 8th house, which encompasses transformation, shared resources, intimacy, and the occult. Libra individuals may find themselves undergoing a period of introspection and letting go of old patterns or attachments that no longer serve their growth, particularly in the realm of shared finances or intimate relationships, allowing for greater personal transformation and renewal. In personal matters, Libra individuals can anticipate happiness and love in their lives, with unwavering support from their partners. Singles may receive promising commitments from potential partners, while those in relationships may experience heightened intensity and emotional connection. However, caution is advised against becoming entangled in extramarital affairs, which could jeopardize the quality of existing relationships. The key to navigating this transit lies in maintaining open communication, trust, and mutual respect in all partnerships. Professionally, 
Libra individuals are poised for success during this transit, with opportunities for recognition and advancement in both salaried employment and entrepreneurial ventures. Joint ventures and partnerships are particularly favored, offering avenues for innovation and progress. Libra individuals may find themselves drawn to collaborative projects that allow them to showcase their talents and creativity. However, it is essential for Libra individuals to maintain boundaries and integrity in all areas of life to ensure long-term success and fulfillment. On a more personal level, Libra individuals may feel an enhanced sense of attractiveness and magnetism during this transit, leading to indulgent spending on cosmetic and luxury products. While gestures of generosity towards partners are encouraged, Libra individuals must be mindful of inviting unnecessary attention and potential scandals. This period is ideal for romantic pursuits, with opportunities for blossoming relationships and heartfelt expressions of affection. However, Libra individuals must remain vigilant against jealousy and gossip from external sources, which may seek to undermine their relationships. By fostering open communication and trust with their partners, Libra individuals can navigate these challenges with grace and resilience. Overall, Venus's transit through the seventh house brings a mix of blessings and challenges for Libra individuals. While personal relationships and professional endeavors are poised for growth and success, vigilance against temptation and external influences is crucial. By maintaining integrity, balance, and a focus on personal and professional growth, Libra individuals can make the most of this transformative period and emerge stronger and more fulfilled in both their personal and professional lives. Scorpio individuals find themselves amidst a transformative transit as Venus gracefully transitions into Aries, their sixth house. This placement typically shines a spotlight on service, health, and daily routines, urging Scorpio individuals to adopt a holistic approach to well-being and interpersonal dynamics. With Venus governing Scorpio's 7th and 12th houses, which encompass marriage, partnerships, loss, expenditure, and long travel, its transit through the 6th house presents a nuanced blend of influences. While Venus traditionally signifies love and harmony, its presence in this house may introduce complexities and challenges in personal and professional relationships. Scorpio individuals must navigate these dynamics with care, balancing the desire for service and self-care with the potential disruptions in partnerships. The sixth house's focus on service and health encourages Scorpio individuals to engage in acts of kindness and self-improvement. Whether through volunteer work, acts of charity, or prioritizing personal wellness routines, Scorpio individuals are called to cultivate a sense of balance and fulfillment in their daily lives. However, they must remain vigilant against potential conflicts or misunderstandings that may arise in their interactions with others, particularly spouses and partners. With Venus as the seventh house lord transiting twelfth away in the sixth house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the seventh house, which governs partnerships, marriage, and one-on-one -on -one relationships. Scorpio individuals may find themselves reassessing their relationships and partnerships during this time. There could be a sense of closure or detachment from certain relationships that no longer serve their growth or align with their values. This transit encourages Scorpio individuals to let go of unhealthy relationship dynamics or attachments. In personal relationships, Scorpio individuals may encounter hurdles and tensions during this transit. Careful communication and emotional intelligence are essential to navigate disagreements and maintain harmony in partnerships. Singles seeking romantic connections may find themselves drawn to individuals who share their values and commitment to personal growth but must exercise caution against rushing into commitments prematurely. For those already engaged or in committed relationships, Venus's transit through the sixth house may bring challenges to the forefront. Health issues, financial strain, or disagreements over daily routines could strain partnerships if not addressed with empathy and understanding. It is imperative for Scorpio individuals to prioritize open communication and mutual support to weather these challenges together. Financial matters may also require attention during this transit, with Venus's influence potentially impacting spending patterns and budgeting. Scorpio individuals are advised to exercise prudence and restraint in their expenditures, avoiding unnecessary expenses and prioritizing long-term financial stability. Caution is advised in matters of debt and borrowing, as impulsive decisions could lead to long-term consequences. For Scorpio individuals contemplating foreign travel or residing abroad, this transit may bring mixed outcomes. While opportunities for job advancements or financial gains may arise, there is also a risk of encountering health issues or facing challenges in marital life. Compliance with local laws and regulations is crucial to avoid legal entanglements while abroad, and Scorpio individuals must prioritize their well-being and safety at all times. 
The aspect of Venus on Scorpio's 12th house further emphasizes the potential for increased expenses and challenges, particularly in health matters. Mental stress and anxiety may be heightened during this period, necessitating the prioritization of self-care practices such as yoga, meditation, and mindfulness. Overall, Venus's transit through Aries presents Scorpio individuals with a period of both growth and challenges. While opportunities for service, personal growth, and romantic connections abound, Scorpio individuals must navigate potential disruptions in relationships and finances with care and resilience. By prioritizing communication, empathy, and self-care, Scorpio individuals can harness the transformative energies of this transit to emerge stronger and more balanced in all aspects of their lives. Sagittarius individuals can anticipate a period of heightened creativity, passion, and romantic expression as Venus enters Aries. The transit of Venus through the fifth house suggests a surge of inspiration, prompting individuals to engage in creative pursuits, hobbies, and artistic endeavors. This could lead to the initiation of new romantic relationships, the revival of existing ones, or a rekindling of passion within partnerships. It's a time marked by joy, playfulness, and embracing one's inner child. For Sagittarius individuals, Venus rules both the sixth and eleventh houses, influencing areas related to debt, sickness, rivalry, financial gains, and desire fulfillment. As Venus transits through the fifth house, which governs love, children, education, and speculation, there's a promise of positive outcomes, especially with the supportive relationship between Venus and Jupiter, the Lord of Sagittarius. This alignment indicates a balanced influence on professional endeavors, with good prospects for promotion or recognition in the service industry. With Venus as the 6th house lord transiting 12th away in the 5th house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the 6th house, which governs health, work, daily routines, and conflicts. There could be a sense of closure or detachment from certain work-related obligations or health practices that no longer serve their well-being. This transit encourages Sagittarius individuals to let go of stressors and unhealthy habits, allowing for greater peace and balance in their daily lives. Venus as the 11th house lord transiting 7th away in the 5th house, Sagittarius individuals may find themselves focusing on creating harmonious connections and collaborations with others. There could be opportunities for networking through hobbies, sports, joining forces with like-minded individuals, or forming alliances. This transit encourages Sagittarius individuals to embrace teamwork and cooperation in their pursuit of personal and professional success. However, caution is advised for self-employed individuals to refrain from lending or borrowing money during this transit to avoid financial setbacks. Venus's aspect on the 11th house of profits and the 5th house of creativity, while in its own sign of Libra, suggests financial benefits from various sources. This could manifest as increased income from investments, speculation, or even marriage-related gains. On a personal level, Sagittarius individuals may experience minor disagreements with partners or loved ones, but their wisdom and efforts can help navigate through these challenges. Single individuals have a decent chance of forming new connections that could potentially lead to meaningful commitments. Students are likely to excel academically, maintaining high marks for themselves. It's important for Sagittarius individuals to be mindful of potential conflicts in romantic relationships, as there may be situations resembling breakups due to misunderstandings or discord. Careful interaction with individuals of the opposite sex is advised during this time. However, friendships will flourish, and Sagittarius individuals will enjoy spending time with close friends, indulging in activities like watching movies and socializing. This transit offers opportunities for Sagittarius individuals to monetize their skills and talents, gaining popularity among friends who will encourage them to pursue their ambitions. Financially, there's potential for significant gains, especially in the stock market or through speculative ventures. For married individuals, spending quality time with their spouse is highlighted while those with children can expect improved relationships with them. It's crucial to avoid extramarital affairs and maintain honesty in all relationships. The aspect of Venus on the 11th house suggests the possibility of reconciling with estranged friends or family members, fostering positive relationships with well-wishers. Overall, the transit of Venus in the 5th house brings forth opportunities for profit, progress, and success. Sagittarius individuals are advised to capitalize on these favorable circumstances particularly in areas such as the stock market and commodity trading, while maintaining integrity in their relationships and financial dealings. With positivity, prosperity, and support from loved ones, this transit promises a fulfilling period for Sagittarius individuals.
Capricorn individuals can anticipate a period of heightened activity on the domain of home, family, and emotional fulfillment as Venus transits into Aries. Positioned in the fourth house, Venus casts its gentle glow upon the domestic sphere, prompting Capricorn individuals to channel their energies into creating a harmonious and aesthetically pleasing living environment. There's an innate urge to beautify and enhance the home, whether through redecorating, renovating, or simply spending quality time with loved ones in the cozy confines of their abode. For Capricorn individuals, Venus holds sway over the fifth and tenth houses, domains that govern love, procreation, speculation, and professional standing. As Venus traverses through the fourth house, which signifies motherhood, home stability, wealth, and serenity, Capricorn individuals can anticipate a period of auspicious developments, particularly in matters pertaining to family dynamics and career advancement. With Venus as the fifth house lord transiting twelfth away in the fourth house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the fifth house, which governs creativity, romance, children, and self-expression. There could be a sense of closure or detachment from certain creative endeavors or romantic pursuits that no longer resonate with their desires or aspirations. On a deeply personal level, the transit of Venus in the fourth house augurs well for Capricorn individuals' familial relationships. There's a palpable sense of warmth, affection, and open communication within the family unit, fostering a nurturing and supportive environment. Partnerships, whether marital or romantic, are imbued with a newfound sense of closeness and understanding, potentially culminating in significant milestones such as marriage or the welcoming of a new addition to the family. The presence of Venus also signifies a special bond with the mother figure, who may play a pivotal role in offering guidance and support in both personal and professional endeavors. Capricorn individuals engaged in creative industries, such as design, music production, media, or art, are poised to thrive during this transit. With Venus exerting its influence on the career house in Libra, there's a promise of financial gains through diligent effort and strategic planning. This period may witness the expansion of businesses, innovative ventures, or lucrative opportunities for career advancement. The rise of remote working arrangements presents Capricorn individuals with the flexibility to balance professional aspirations with the comforts of home life. The transit encourages Capricorn individuals to indulge their creative impulses and artistic sensibilities within the sanctuary of their homes. Whether it's working on DIY projects, cultivating hobbies, or even launching a home-based enterprise, this period offers ample opportunities for self-expression and fulfillment. Investments in home comforts, such as acquiring new vehicles or properties, may also feature prominently, further enhancing Capricorn individuals' sense of security and well-being. While basking in the warmth of domestic bliss, Capricorn individuals are reminded to prioritize the health and well-being of their mother, whose support and wisdom may prove invaluable during this time. However, overall familial relationships, including those with the father, are likely to be characterized by mutual respect, affection, and solidarity. From a financial standpoint, Capricorn individuals can expect to reap significant rewards, particularly through prudent investments and strategic business decisions. Venus's aspect on the 10th house portends opportunities for professional growth, including promotions, salary increments, or the emergence of new avenues for income generation. This transit indicates a period of comfort, prosperity, and recognition, elevating Capricorn individuals' stature and financial standing within their professional and social spheres. Overall, the transit of Venus in Aries indicates a chapter of domestic harmony, career success, and financial prosperity for Capricorn individuals. By nurturing familial bonds, unleashing their creative potential, and seizing upon lucrative opportunities, Capricorn individuals can harness the transformative energies of this transit. Aquarius individuals are poised to embark on a transformative journey characterized by heightened curiosity, dynamic communication, and enriching social interactions as Venus transits into Aries. With Venus gracing the third house, Aquarius individuals find themselves drawn to the exploration of new ideas, hobbies, and intellectual pursuits. This transit sparks a thirst for knowledge, encouraging Aquarius individuals to engage in stimulating conversations with siblings, neighbors, and peers, fostering a vibrant exchange of ideas and perspectives. Short trips, weekend getaways, and local adventures become avenues for exploration and discovery, further fueling Aquarius individuals' quest for personal growth and enlightenment. Venus rules Aquarius's fourth and ninth houses, domains associated with domestic happiness, stability, luck, spirituality, and long-distance travel. As Venus transits through the third house, governing courage, communication, 
short trips, and sibling relationships, Aquarius individuals can anticipate a harmonious blend of personal and professional development. This alignment of energies promises favorable outcomes and opportunities for growth in various aspects of life. With Venus as the fourth house lord transiting twelfth away in the third house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the fourth house, which governs home, family, roots, and emotional security. There could be a sense of closure or detachment from certain family dynamics, living situations, or emotional attachments that no longer serve their well-being or growth. This transit encourages Aquarius individuals to let go of outdated emotional patterns or attachments. Professionally, Aquarius individuals may find themselves on the brink of significant advancements, particularly in fields that prioritize communication and creativity. Whether in journalism, blogging, or other forms of media, Aquarius individuals are likely to garner recognition and appreciation for their innovative ideas and insightful perspectives. Those venturing into entrepreneurial endeavors may benefit from travel opportunities, as networking and collaboration pave the way for new ventures and expanded horizons. On the personal front, Aquarius individuals can look forward to strengthened bonds with loved ones, particularly partners, siblings, and family members. Clear and effective communication skills play a pivotal role in fostering understanding, cooperation, and unity within the family unit. This period may witness the fulfillment of personal goals and aspirations, with the unwavering support and encouragement of those closest to them. Students pursuing higher education, especially abroad, may find success with the guidance of mentors and the unwavering support of paternal figures. During this transit, Aquarius individuals may experience a deepening interest in spiritual concepts and philosophical inquiries. The urge to delve into profound topics of spirituality and consciousness may prompt Aquarius individuals to contemplate writing or sharing their insights with others. Pilgrimages to sacred sites or distant travels could provide opportunities for spiritual growth and enlightenment, enriching Aquarius individuals' understanding of themselves and the world around them. Enhanced communication with parents, particularly the mother and father figures, fosters deeper connections and mutual understanding within the family dynamic. Aquarius individuals may find themselves drawn to meaningful conversations and shared experiences with their parents, strengthening familial bonds and creating lasting memories. Venus's auspicious aspect on the ninth house promises a period of luck, prosperity, and abundance for Aquarius individuals. Financial gains and opportunities for career advancement abound, particularly through effective communication channels. Those engaged in IT-related fields may find themselves on the path to success, with prospects for promotions, salary increments, and lucrative contracts. Overall, the transit of Venus in Aries indicates a period of growth, exploration, and personal development for Aquarius individuals. With a focus on communication, learning, and social interaction, Aquarius individuals are poised to seize upon opportunities for advancement in both personal and professional spheres. Through clear communication, harmonious relationships, and a spirit of curiosity and adventure, Aquarius individuals can navigate this transformative phase with confidence, embracing the blessings of luck, prosperity, and fulfillment that Venus has to offer. For Pisces individuals, as Venus transits into Aries, its passage through the second house casts a spotlight on themes of value, stability, and material abundance. This transit ushers in a period where financial matters take focus, prompting a closer examination of personal finances and assets. Pisces individuals may find themselves naturally drawn to activities such as budgeting, investing, or even indulging in a bit of shopping. The transit of Venus through the second house encourages individuals to cultivate a deeper appreciation for the simple pleasures of life and to foster gratitude for the familial bonds that bring comfort and security. Given that Venus rules both the third and eighth houses in the Pisces individual's horoscope, its transit through the second house of speech, family, and finances brings forth a mix of positive possibilities and potential challenges. While Venus in Aries typically signifies forward momentum and initiative, Caution is advised to prevent any unforeseen setbacks, especially considering Venus's influence over obstacles and sudden gains or losses. During this time, it's important for Pisces individuals to remain vigilant, as competitors may attempt to undermine their professional reputation, injecting an element of unpredictability into their career prospects. However, despite these challenges, there's an opportunity for couples to strengthen their financial foundation by saving together for future gains. With Venus as the third house lord transiting twelfth away in the second house, there's a theme of closure and letting go in matters related to the third house, which governs communication, siblings, short trips, and mental activities. 
There could be a sense of closure or detachment from certain communication patterns or friendships that no longer serve their growth or well-being. This transit encourages Pisces individuals to let go of mental clutter or negative thought patterns, allowing for greater clarity and peace of mind. Venus as the 8th house lord transiting 7th away in the 2nd house, Pisces individuals may find themselves focusing on creating harmonious connections and collaborations in matters related to shared finances, intimacy, or psychological healing. There could be opportunities for deepening emotional bonds with partners or forming alliances that facilitate personal transformation and growth. Traveling may present a mixed bag of experiences for Pisces individuals during this transit. While it may not necessarily be beneficial for personal relationships, as disagreements with partners or family members could surface, it does offer a chance to mend any rifts with the partner's family. Pisces individuals are advised to exercise restraint when it comes to spending, as excessive indulgence could lead to dramatic fluctuations in both health and wealth, given Venus's lordship over the eighth house. Despite potential misunderstandings with close family members, there's an undeniable allure towards luxuries, whether it's dining out at exotic restaurants or experimenting with gourmet cooking at home. Venus's transit through the second house of the Pisces individual's horoscope holds promising prospects, particularly in the area of finances. The comfort that Venus finds in this house suggests significant financial gains for Pisces individuals during this period. Short-distance journeys are likely to yield fruitful results, offering support and mitigating any losses that may have been incurred. Marital life may experience a positive upswing, as the transit fosters quality time and deeper connection with one's spouse. Professionals involved in creative endeavors, education, or research-related fields are poised to benefit greatly from this transit. Opportunities for sudden financial gains abound and support from family members and elders is readily available. While challenges in marital life persist due to the presence of Rahu in the Ascendant and Ketu in the seventh house, the transit brings a glimmer of hope, particularly through financial prosperity. Overall, the transit of Venus through Aries and its subsequent journey through the second house indicates a period of both opportunity and challenge for Pisces individuals. By navigating these transits with a balanced approach, individuals born under this sign can expect to emerge stronger both financially and emotionally, as they embrace the blessings and lessons that this transit has to offer. As we wrap up this transit episode, remember that these insights are based on sidereal or Vedic astrology, which accounts for the approximately 24 degree difference with the tropical zodiac. If you'd like more personalized predictions for their specific zodiac sign or have any questions about their astrological chart, feel free to reach out to us. Stay tuned for more astrological updates. If they found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more astrology insights. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so they never miss an update. Thank they once again for joining us, and we eagerly anticipate sharing more astrological wisdom with they in the future. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep shining bright.